Felix and Regula are Coptic Orthodox and Roman Catholic saints, together with their servant Exuperantius, and are the patron saints of Zurich, their feast day being the 11th of September at the head of the Coptic calendar. History Felix and Regula were siblings, and members of the Theban legion under Saint Maurice, stationed in Agonim in the Valais. When the legion was to be executed in 286, they fled, reaching Zurich via Glarus before they were caught, tried and executed. After decapitation, they miraculously stood to their feet, picked up their own heads, walked forty paces uphill, and prayed before lying down in death. They were buried on the spot where they lay down, on the hilltop which would become the site of the Grossmünster. The story was revealed in a dream to a monk called Florentius. It largely contributed to the massive conversion of the inhabitants of these regions to Christianity and had such an impact on Zurich that these three saints still appear on the coat of arms and seal of Zurich today. In the 9th century, there was a small monastery at the location, outside the settlement of Zurich which was situated on the left side of the limit. The Grossmünster was built on their graves from ca. 1100, while at the site of their execution stands the Wasserkirch. From the 13th century, images of the saints were used in official seals of the city and on coins. On the saints' feast day, their relics were carried in procession between the Grossmünster and the Fraumünster, and the two monasteries vied for possession of the relics, which attracted enough pilgrims to make Zurich the most important pilgrimage site in the bishopric of Constanz. The Nabenschießen of Zurich originates with the feast day of the saints on of September, which came to be the national holiday of the early modern Republic of Zurich. With the dissolution of the monasteries by Huldrych Zwingli in 1524, their possessions were confiscated and the graves of the martyrs were opened. There are conflicting versions of what happened then. Heinrich Bullinger claims that the graves were empty save for a few bone fragments, which were piously buried in the common graveyard outside the church. The Catholics, on the other hand, claimed that the reformers were planning to throw the relics of the saints into the river, and that a courageous man of Uri who happened to be exiled from Uri, and by his action earned amnesty stole the relics from the church and carried them to Andermatt, where the two skulls of Felix and Regula can be seen to this day, while the remaining relics were returned to Zurich in 1950, to the newly built Catholic Church St. Felix und Regula. The skulls have been carbon-14 dated, and while one dates to the Middle Ages, the other is in fact composed of fragments of two separate skulls, of which one is medieval, and the other could indeed date to Roman times. References Literature in German Hanswele Etter, Urs Bauer, Jörg Hanser, Jörg Schneider, HRSG, Die Zürcher Stadtheiligen Felix und Regula. Legenden, Relikien, Geschichte und IHRE Botschaft im Licht moderner Forschung. Hochbaum der Stadt Zürich, Büro für Archäologie, Zürich 1988, ISBN 3-905243-01-6. Walter Nigg, Felix und Regula, Anining einer Legende, Zürich. SV International, Schweizer Verlagshaus, 1983. ISBN 3-7263-6361-0 Jörg Hanser, Armin Mathis, Ulrich Ruoff, Jörg Schneider, Das Neue Bild des Alten Zürich, Zürich 1983 Cecil Raymer, Felix, Regula und Exuperantius, Iconographie der Stifts und Stadtheiligen Zürichs, Zürich, Antiquarische Gesellschaft, 1973 Topic. External links Topic. CPG 111, 1470s manuscript containing the legend of Felix and Regula as well as that of St. Meinrad. University of Zurich, Die Stadt Zurich und IHRE Martyrer, ein Multimedialer PFAD in German Orthodox Vesper in honor of St. Felix, St. Regula and St. Exuperantius Saints Germain et Randold, Martyrs. <laughs>